Today, I'm going to train like David Goggins, which might suck because he's a tough cookie. He's a retired Navy SEAL, ultra marathoner, and he can do a lot of pull-ups. Like a lot. 4,030 in 24 hours to be exact. But today, I'm going to set out to beat that number. Have I been training for it? No, not really. I do do pull-ups sometimes, but not really for reps, and I think the most I've ever done in a row is about 25. But I'm not doing anything today, so I figure this is a good day to, you know, try to set the world record for pull-ups. I am underprepared though, so I'm gonna go to the store after I bang out like 100 pull-ups here. So that's the game plan. I also made a mark on my body, so you know I did it all in one day. I didn't know what to draw, so I just scribbled all over myself. The first hundo wasn't that bad, and I even started showing off a little bit. Maybe I'm getting a little too tacky. 100, I think. <laughs> kind of lost count. All right, I'm ready. I also made an agreement with myself that I'll do a pull-up on every single pull-up bar I see, just to prove that the world's your pull-up bar. Some were a little bit hard to get to, though. Black Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Got everything you need to set a pull-up world record. You know, I'm not a marine biologist, but if my math is correct, I believe that is 150, which means I just have 3,880 to go. 151, 152, 153. I feel like people don't talk about chocolate milk and frosted mini wheats enough. I think it slaps, and it's the perfect amount of fuel you need to do more pull-ups. 209 down and I decided to move to a new pull-up bar because I was kind of getting bored. So I started wandering. And I found a basketball court. Which is totally rad because playing basketball is in my bloodline. You know, Brian Scalabrini is actually my uncle. It got a little bit too cold outside though so I had to walk away. Although it's very warm in Wisconsin for this time of year. It's a lot warmer here. I'm at my parents' house. But we're losing daylight so I gotta get going. I made this. I'm thinking about turning this into an art channel. Let me know. I was a little too fatigued to keep doing 10 reps, so I switched it up into sets of five, which still proved to be difficult. Yeah, and my brain was just not cooperating with counting the pull-ups. I can barely count my 10 reps at the gym. I knew I wasn't gonna be able to count these. Yeah, I got too warm inside, so I moved outside. But then I got serious. So as I'm looking good, I'm starting to do CrossFit pull-ups. And that guy's kind of creeping me out. My forearms are starting to cramp every time I bend them. <laughs> it's painful. We're making pretty good progress though. Don't know what number I'm on, but I'm starting to feel it. Ugh. I was in my garage for about three hours with nothing but music. So yeah, things got weird. Got to go to work in 30 minutes, so I'm gonna do as many as I can in the next like 10 minutes, and then oh, lost my AirPod. Then I'll take a shower, go to work, and we will continue there. The day of the doubt. And there wasn't a lot of places to do pull-ups at my work, but I found a spot: the bathroom. I really hope my boss doesn't see this video, but whatever. Don't forget. And these fools I was serving had no idea that their server was on pull-up number 622. I didn't know either because I lost count by that point, but still. I break away to do a whole bunch of pull-ups at work. A little bit disappointed about it, but just gonna spend the rest of the night doing pull-ups here. Maybe pull up a movie. I'm gonna have myself a night and just do some pull-ups. Oh, and I totally forgot I ended up taking a shower. So that whole mark thing I said I was gonna do, that's out the window. But let's do some more pull-ups.
Once I got into the 800s, my hands really started to hurt. I don't know if you can tell by my facial expressions, but I was in pain. After doing all these pull-ups, my back was starting to look pretty thick. And if I'm being completely honest, I spent the majority of my night doing lat spreads in the mirror. I felt like Godzilla. Well, I'm definitely done doing pull-ups for the day. 12 o'clock now, started at nine. <clears throat> I could definitely do more, but I'm not really trying to, you know, pull an all-nighter and I gotta hit legs tomorrow anyways, so that's all for me. But I think I got a good amount from 9 to 12. I don't really know the number, but respect to David Goggins though, like 4,000, that's, that's tough. Especially in the hands, that's the thing that hurts the most. But anyways, thank you for watching. If you want to buy a t-shirt, I'll love you forever, but have a great day. Peace. I'm moving on.